Uh, welcome to our hands-on school. Uh, today our topic is SI unit for current. And now uh, we have a student what's your name? Hi, my name is Abu Nawaz Ibrahim. Nice to see you again. Oh, nice to nice to see you indeed. Um, so uh, can you remind me, remind the class, what is SI unit? Well, SI unit with the Sistema International, which is French, and it is um, the successor of the metric system. Yes, it is. Now, there are how many fundamental quantity in the universe? Also, remind you to the class, if you may. Seven. Seven it is. And uh, now, you tell me how many SI units associated to seven fundamental quantity. Please do remind you to. Well, seven times class. one is equal to seven. So. Yes, true. Now... How many we have learned last few days? Four. Four of them. What are they? And so length is meters. Yes. Time is second. Yes. Mass is kilograms. Yes. And demand of substance is moles. That is correct. Now today we're gonna learn a current and as a unit, mm. as a unit for current is ampere, and that's it. I will see you tomorrow. Wait, no, no, don't leave. I don't understand. Uh, what part do you don't understand? Okay, uh, sure. Uh, all right, so Let's now. Uh, okay, okay, sure. So you want to know what is current and what, yeah, what is the yeah, relationship between current and the ampere, right? Yeah, I really. So the current, so the current is the the amount, the flow of charges, the flow of charges in a closed loop from one point to other point in a given amount of time. What did they say? So the amount of charges that are passing through a certain point in an electric uh, uh, circuit per second? Yes, that is true. Can you can you draw the picture version of this definition? Um, okay then. So to make sure the paper doesn't bleed, I know to draw like this. So is that how it looks like? This is a closed loop, but um, we, I think we need to have a battery. Uh, oh, the, a battery. the battery is the source of voltage. So like this, so that's the voltage. Did I forget anything else? It's almost, uh, um, it is, yeah, I think it's almost good, but uh, resistance is something I think you need to put. Ah, okay. Uh, okay, so, so the current flows from positive terminal to negative terminal, then, everything looks good. And then the resistor sucks up some of the current so when it gets back to the battery all right so this is as good uh this is this is good enough for our purpose so it is yeah amount of uh, charges uh, passes from one point to other point in a given amount of time that is indeed current ah. okay so can you now write using this uh, definition and picture can you write the equation so what is it what is the so, equation second remind me of time and then this is current and then the amount of charges so that would be t but over time would look like that's the delta correct. t and i believe delta that's t correct the student is very smart the i for current uh q for charges and the symbol and we use the q. delta and delta and delta uh, uh, delta is uh, the difference and the time uh, delta t the difference of time so the current is the uh, uh, change uh, change, um, change, uh, change of charges over, over change of time. But there is a SI unit for Q, Coulomb, and we already learned the SI unit for time. Second. Second. So Coulomb over second, there is, um, there is a, there is a thing, uh, there is a name for it, ampere. Wait. Let me explain. So, amount of charges past a point, a specific point, in a given amount of time is that many electrons ah. okay so that many electron can pass who carries the electron Every who second. carries that who carries the electron hmm. so the circuit charges carries the electron the charges charges carries the electron how many but they, these are just charges uh, they how many can be either positive or negative yes. flowing through yes. the circuit so charges carries the electron okay mm -hmm. so very nice now 
But yeah. wh how is it uh, in Ampere? Why is it named Ampere and not like Friedrich uh, Gauss or That's something right. so else? Ampere, uh, he was a French man. He was born in 1775 in French. Andrew he Mary Ampere? Andrew Mary Ampere and uh, it seems like you know him. Uh, uh, he I, lived. I just remember your name. I don't remember anything. About you did your homework then. Uh, yeah, that's good. Uh, yeah, so he lived uh, sixty-one years. So what? Uh, what year he uh, he passed away? Do you remember? Wait, but you didn't tell me when he was born. Seventeen seventy-five. Wait, so if he was born in seventeen seventy-five, that means if you do the math, so seventeen seventy-five plus sixty-one, that's gonna be. One eighteen thirty, and then that extra five plus one is eighteen thirty six. Yeah, he died in eighteen thirty six. But you know, eighteen o two, he did something uh, revolutionary. What? what is that? A unit for current. Uh, coulombs. No, no, not, not coulombs. I here. Ampere. There's a unit for current is ampere, and what is the symbol for current? I. And what is the symbol for charges? And what is the S uh, symbol for time? Uh, T. All right. So I is equal to Q over? Q over T. And that gives us Coulomb over second. And that is Ampere. Uh, All right. Now, can you put the understanding in action? Can you create current? Sit down, sit down, sit down. So we need one battery, two batteries. You want me to hold on? Mm, no, it's fine. You so, sure? <gasps> oh! <laughs> oh! Okay, oh, wow. so it's kind of dark. It's shining this, on your shirt. This is amazing. So in the beginning, this student had no understanding about current. But when I told him that as a unit for current is ampere, he refused to uh, he refused to memorize that information. Instead, he asked me what is the definition of current and how it's related to ampere and why uh, ampere, why as a unit for current is ampere. And then I told, um, I had to show him everything. Now he put that understanding in action by lighting up a bulb, which is good. Now I oh have to God, go. I see I have an, for part of I have, I have another classes. Uh, so good luck. Uh, all right, bye. What happened to Sally? Did I steal her bike? Bye. Bye. Bye.